Welcome to Infigyan friends. In this very very exciting video of rational equation challenges, we are going to solve one very interesting problem. 9x over x square plus 1 whole square minus 2 over x plus 1 whole square equal to 0. So let's get started by writing the domain. See denominator cannot be 0. So x plus 1 if it is not equal to 0 then we can conclude x is not equal to negative 1. Similarly, second bracket that is x square plus 1 also cannot be equal to 0. So I can write x cannot be equal to plus minus i. So this solution we will exempt. Okay, let's solve. Let's simplify first. So I will take LCM. So let us consider x square plus 1 whole square times x plus 1 whole square. So here I can write 9x times x plus 1 whole square negative 2 x square plus 1 whole square. In next step I will write 9x times x plus 1 whole square minus 2 x square plus 1 whole square it would be equal to 0. Now I will expand it. So 9x in bracket I will write x square plus 2x plus 1 minus 2 expand this one also. So I will get x power 4 plus 1 plus 2x square equal to 0. Then I will write 9x cube plus 18x square plus 9x minus 2x power 4 minus 2 minus 4x square it is equal to 0. Now let's write in the descending order form. So minus 2x power 4. Now I will write plus 9x cube. 18x square minus 4x square. So 14x square plus 9x minus 2 equal to 0. Now I will multiply with negative 1 both sides. So it will change its sign. 2x power 4 minus 9x cube minus 14x square minus 9x plus 2 equal to 0. Now see this quartic equation. It is having the identical coefficients. Leading coefficient and constant it is same. One degree shorter it is same and see this is pi y. So reciprocal equation is about to come. So how I will write it? I will take two common from the first and last term and minus 9 common from the second and second last term. Let's take common. So I will write 2 x power 4 plus 1. Okay. Then I will take minus 9 common. So it will become x cube plus x. And then what is left? That is minus 14 x square equal to 0. Now I will divide this equation by x square as x cannot be equal to 0. It is not solution of the equation. You can see I will put x equal to 0 then first term is 0 minus 2 over 1 it is equal to 0. No. So x not equal to 0. So I am dividing this equation by x square. So I can write 2 x square plus 1 over x square minus 9 x plus 1 over x and minus 14 is equal to 0. Now I will consider one substitution that is x plus 1 over x. Let me write equal to suppose a. So if I will take whole square of that, 
So I can write x square plus 1 over x square plus 2 equal to a square or x square plus 1 over x square a square minus 2. So here I will write a square minus 2 and see this is a. So I will write my equation as 2 times a square minus 2 minus 9a minus 14 equal to 0. Let's expand 2a square minus 4 minus 9a minus 14 equal to 0. So 2a square minus 9a minus 18 equal to 0. Now I will solve for a. Let's apply quadratic formula. So I will write a is equal to minus b 9 plus minus a square root b square. So 81 minus 4ac. 4 times 2 is 8. 18 times 8 is 144. So I will write plus 144 divided by 4. So 9 plus minus square root 225 divided by 4 and we know that it is 9 plus minus square root 225 is 15 over 4. If I will consider plus sign then I will write 24 over 4 so 6. If I will consider minus sign then I will have minus 9 over 4 so that we will get minus 3 over 2. Okay cancel by 3. So our two values of a that is a equal to 6 and minus 3 by 2. Now I will put back our a. a was x plus 1 over x. Let's put. So I will write two equations x plus 1 over x is equal to 6 and second equation is x plus 1 over x equal to minus 3 over 2. Let's solve. Multiply this equation with x. So x is square minus 6x plus 1 equal to 0. Multiply this one also. So x square plus 3 by 2x plus 1 equal to 0. So I will apply quadratic formula. See from the first equation I can write x is equal to minus b. So 6 plus minus b square. So 36 minus 4ac divided by 2. It will give us 6 plus minus square root 32 divided by 2. Now I can write it is 8 times 4. So 2 root 8 this we can write or let me write here plus minus 2 root 8 over 2. So 3 plus minus square root 8. Two real values of x. Okay. Or we can write x is equal to 3 plus minus 2 root 2. Okay. Now come to this quadratic equation. I will multiply with 2 first. So I will write 2x square plus 3x plus 2 equal to 0. Quadratic formula, Sridharachar formula, x is equal to minus b. So minus 3 plus minus square root b square. So 3 square is 9 minus 4 ac, 4 times 4, 16 divided by 2a, so 4. So this will give us minus 3 plus minus, it is 7 left. So I will write i square root 7 over 4. So our final solution becomes minus 3 plus minus i square root 7 over 4. Now remember two solutions are real which is 3 plus 2 root 2 plus and 3 minus 2 root 2 and two are imaginary and cross check out of four solution none of solution is negative 1. Remember the limitation, the domain and x cannot be equal to plus minus i. 
so it is not so our solutions are accepted i hope you like this video thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe bye bye till next video good luck